Hi, my name is Ryan Cornelius. I'm candidate number 4136. And my question was, to what extent has AI been misused in the United States? For our group differential, we put Elias Sadumi on technological lens, Andrew Legrand covering the economic, and myself doing the political. Background information. Artificial intelligence, or AI, simply means software used by computers to mimic aspects of human intelligence. AI systems can be misused by criminals, state organizations, or economic competitors for dishonest purposes. Chat GBT and student abuse. Since November 30th, 2022, Chat GBT has officially taken over the internet. Students have utilized this tool to cheat on exams and even complete homework. College board governments like Harvard have started to increase browser security, but many students are questioning whether this is an invasion of privacy or not. Growing concerns. According to the graph, Americans lean towards concern over excitement when it comes to the increased use of AI in daily life. 37% are more concerned than excited, 45% are equally concerned and excited. 18% are more excited than concerned. So the vast majority are more concerned than excited. Local issue. President Biden's voice was deep faked by Voice Lab, a platform created by an AI startup company titled 11 Labs. The virtual Biden was heard using inappropriate language, admitting to marijuana use and denouncing transgender people. Cause for concern. These systems can cause the majority population to be deceived, and prominent political figures' voices can be replicated and programmed to say whatever the user inputs into the system. Eleven Labs offers a service for $5 a month, so it's readily available to anybody paying $5 to the general public. Eleven Labs also released a statement in response, stating, Crazy Weekend, thank you for everybody for trying out our beta platform. While we see our tech being overwhelming, overwhelmingly applied to positive use, we also see an increasing number of voice cloning misuse cases. We want to reach out to Twitter community for thoughts and feedback. While we can trace back any generated audio back to the user, we'd like to address this by implementing additional safeguards. While they are implementing additional safeguards, this problem is still very early in the process as it's only a beta platform. Global issue, Spain. Artificial intelligence is being used by pedophiles to create disturbing photos of minors. Police in Spain arrest the, arrested a computer programmer who had used AI to create these images. This was the first of its kind, and there's no, there's no police or laws in place to, to do anything about this yet. Some solutions would be the Council of the EU and the Artificial Intelligence Regulation, also known as the AI Act, increased cybersecurity, and meaningful penalty for perpetrators. So limitations to my solutions could be countries a part of the EU may not be affected because of low income countries that may not be able to pay money for the cause. And cybersecurity against AI is still in its very early stages since all of these systems have been recently released. Conclusion. Deepfakes and other misuses of AI all result from its rise in the US. To help stop and prevent the abuse of such techn technology, the government should establish legal punishments that would deter users from doing so. And without proper strategy from the government, AI can result in global catastrophe. Nuclear codes can be hijacked, and World War III could possibly start. And here I have my sources, and thank you.